Kia ora ako kia. Your task for today, for maths, is to create your own cool number flashcards. So it's kind of like you get to be the teacher and you get to hold the flashcards. I've made some too. So a flashcard is when you've got one number on a little square and um, it's all cut up. You can play so many different games with your flashcards. Um, one, what we'll do is I'll play a few games with you with mine so you can see the sort of things that you can do. And then, um, yeah, so once you've made your flashcards, you can either put them up on the wall where you can see them everywhere or uh, you can play some games with them. So I've made my flashcards going from 1 all the way through to 10. So that's 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9 and 10. They're all on different cards. If you think, Mrs Hubbard, that's too easy, I already know how to count to 10 easily, then you can go all the way to 20 or even higher if you want. So to start with, I think what we'll do is we'll warm up by counting to 10 in te reo. So I'm going to hold up the number and we'll say it together. You ready? Tahi. Ooh. Rua. Toru. See if you can beat me and say the number before I pick it up. We'll start again, eh? Tahi. Rua. Toru. Fa. Rima, Ono, Fitu, Waru, Iwa, Tiko. We've got all 10 of our numbers. That was pretty cool, eh? So you can practice counting to te reo with your flashcards. Another game you can play with your flashcards is you can play it when someone picks up the card and you have to just look at the number and either say it or a really good one is to show it on your fingers, okay? So we'll play it together for a little bit. I want you to say the number and I also want you to show me on your fingers how much it is. Remember, you've got to do it as fast as you can, okay? So how about this number? What was that number? That was four. Let's see it on our fingers. Did anybody show me this? Four? Or you might have done it like that. Four. Okay. Let's do another number. Um, how about... Oh, this is a good one. I bet you all got that. That one was five. Show me five on your fingers. Yep. And how about... Um, this one. That was ten. Show me ten on your fingers. I need to put my... Put it down. There we go, there's 10. What else have we got here? Ooh, we haven't done this one yet. You ready? Seven. Show me seven on your fingers. That was seven. Five and two more make seven. And we'll do one more. Mm. Oh, this one. Eight. Show me eight on your fingers. You might have this, or you might even have two fours if you're thinking about your doubles. So with your flashcards, you can play lots of games. Um, there's heaps of other ones, but I think it's actually a good opportunity for you to be creative and make your own games. So your task for today is to create your flashcards, make them look really, really cool, and make sure that, that they can last you for a long time. And then I want you to let me know what sort of games you play with them. You can play them with a sibling, they could play with you, or you can play them with a parent or an adult. Cool, can't wait to see. Kakite.